Here's how you can get a perfect delay signal accustomed to your specific preferences. So this is the stock FL Studio basic delay and it has all the essential functions that you would need. Delay is all about timing and setting this knob to match perfectly with the tempo or the beats. So if I click a note, you'll hear that it repeats. A lot of delays sound good with the fourth note or the quarter note. If you change this volume knob for the feedback, it'll only play one delay. And then if you move this cut down and you turn the volume up, then it'll sweep away some of the frequencies quicker than it otherwise would have. The input's very simple, pans it from left to right. And this is the input volume before any of the effects. This dry volume knob will control if you can hear the initial note played, but it won't affect any of the delays after. So you have normal feedback, inverted feedback, which if I have the audio played on the left, then it's going to play on the right. And then ping pong, if I play the audio on the left, it's going to go to the right and then to the left and to the right, and it's going to keep doing that. Hope you found something helpful with this. Follow for more.